Hello, ladies and gentlemen, Jim here. After peppering the nation with thousands of locations, closely held Subway is retrenching. This year, the sandwich purveyor is planning to shut about 500 more of its U.S. shops. Last year, more than 800 stores went dark, with the total U.S. count dropping to 25,908. It also closed restaurants in 2016. We want to make sure that we have the best location. Uh, CEO Suzanne Greco, who is 60, said in a phone interview, we focused in the past on restaurants count. We're focused now on strengthening market share. Store count isn't everything, she said. It's about growing the business. Now, the sandwich shop, uh, founded more than 50 years ago, is struggling to boost sales in the U.S. as newer, more modern chains emerge. Greco said Subway has been hurt by fierce competition in the U.S., including from a resurgent McDonald's corporation, whose domestic system sales rose 3.4% last year, according to data from researcher Technomics. Subway fell 4.4%. Now, Subway is banking on a new loyalty program along with menu innovation to boost traffic. The reward system, which offers $2 discounts and free items, is available for the chain's domestic and Canadian locations. It's also remodeling stores for a sleeker look with touch screen ordering kiosks. I always get the cold cut combo. Call me call me boring but there it is right there that's always been my favorite uh, folks this certainly is interesting I mean I didn't realize at first that Subway had so many restaurants over almost 26,000 of them but it is uh, it is kind of uh, I don't know unnerving that they're closing another 500 stores this year I mean this is just like a shopping malls go now Subway is going it seems I like Subway myself. I mean, it's it's good. It's it's all right. But I'll leave you a link to this, folks. I'd ask you please to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. Please give this video a thumbs up and please share it if you feel so led to. And folks, uh, if you're a truther, if you're tracking the machinations of the deep state, if you're watching the fulfillment of biblical prophecy, if you see America being flipped upside down, then Light a Wayfarer's Story is a fiction book for you. It's my brand new book. Check it out. How fictional is it? And maybe as much nonfiction. Uh, it's linked below in Kindle and paperback. You can get it there. You can also read chapter one for free. That's linked below. Please go check it out, folks. There's also a link to some music of mine and to a PayPal page if you want to buy me a cup of coffee or a Subway sandwich. But most importantly of all, my friends, do not be given over to the spirit of fear, but instead of the power of love and of a sound mind that comes through our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. God bless you.